My name is Haru. Today, I'm shopping here with my college friend Nana. Nana, who has the same taste in fashion as me, is my best friend in the college. We've had a great time shopping and I'm getting hungry. Hmm? Let me see, where can we get some good food? I'd like to eat something filling. Oh, hey, I'm getting hungry, so let's go to that ramen. Wait. Let me guess what you're thinking right now. Spiffy, spiffy, chance. Huh? Spiffy, spiffy? Oh, pecan. Okay, I got it. Haru, you wanna go to that cafe? I just read your mind. Huh? No? Um... Hey, right? I can read people's minds. Yeah, the cafe is also nice, but... Now that... Huh? Haru, I'm right, right? You wanna go to that cafe? I know everything. After all, I'm the successor to that famous Puniki Puniko. Nana is a nice bright girl, but she recently got into spirituality. She claims she's the hair to a famous teacher. And she even made up a catchy line. Apparently, she can read people's minds, see the future, and understand everything. In reality, she just puts the pressures on us to say that she's right. Y you're right. I was just thinking about going to the cafe. <laughs> I mean, I'm not only cute, but I'm also a charismatic, spiritual person, you know? I feel like it's a matter of time before the media notices. Oh, I can see it. A future where I get national attention and marry a famous actor. <laughs> then I will enter the music and fashion industry. And then, and then... I don't feel I'm being told something spiritual. I just feel like I'm being told some random fantasy story. She's been like this in college. Hey, you're Nana, right? Huh? You're cute, so I've always wanted to talk to you. Would you like to go out to eat afterwards? Beef, beef, pecan! Huh? I just read your mind. You like me, right? Oh, sorry. Maybe you're not who I thought you were. Huh? Just like this, she seems to be isolated and distant from everyone these days. Uh, that's right. I should think of a signature right now. Of course, I'll give it to you too. No, I don't want it. Ah, speed speed pecan! Huh? What's wrong? No, this is the worst. I read someone's mind again. You see that guy over there? He's wondering if he should talk to me now because I'm cute. What? <sighs> uh, he's not really my type. See? Our eyes met. I feel like someone is looking at me badly. What is this sign? You like me, like me, like me. Hurry up and speak to me. You should be in love with me! Whoa! What is this pressure? It's like she's talking directly to my brain! No! Please stop it! It's creepy! I should leave this cafe! I should go home and heave salt! Um... Well... Oh, this is so bad! That guy ran away because of Nana's pressure! I think Nana is in a bad mood! Huh, this is so boring. <laughs> I mean, I read his mind, but he thought that I'm too cute for him to talk to. He felt that it would be a waste for me to be with him. <laughs> I lost by worrying. She's super positive. Now I'm probably Nana's only friend, but lately I'm getting tired too. I used to like her positive side, but... I'm a little annoyed at times like this. Welcome. Oh? 
Where's the male customer if you just came in? No one is here? Oh, I guess it was just spirited away. Spirited away of customers, Pony! What? Haru? Narita! Huh? You're working part-time at this cafe? Oh, yeah. I recently started working part-time. I'm pretty popular as a good-looking waiter, you know. Don't say that to yourself. He is a different Narita at the same university. He and Nana must have never met before because they are in different departments. Nana, you haven't met him yet, right? His name is Narita and... Speed, speed, pecan! I know! Huh? I have known you for a long time. Huh? That can't be. We go to the same college, but we're in different departments, and we've never met. No, that's not it. I can see it. Huh? You will definitely like me. I went into this cafe because I knew that in this cafe was the man of my dreams. Nope, she guesses what one is thinking or something. Oh, I'm sorry for the late introduction. I'm Nana, a charismatic and a spiritual college student. Huh? What? Charisma spirit? Oh, I can see it. A happy future for Narita and me. We will get married and raise two kids in a two-story house. Huh? Didn't you just say earlier that you're gonna marry a famous actor? Do you believe in fate, Narita? Yes, you do, right? No, I... What I say is absolute. <sighs> Apparently, Nana fell in love with Narita at first sight. If this happens, Nana will leave no stone unturned to get Narita. Narita, I'm sorry for your loss. You won't be able to get away from her now. H Haru? W wait, what? After retirement, we will travel the world together, and then, and then, and then... It was Narita's bad luck to meet Nana that day. Haru, help me! I'm at my limit! Narita was very ghastly that day. Maybe the cause was Nana. Um, let me ask you, did something happen? I can't imagine what happened though. Ever since I met Nana at the cafe that day. Let's take classes together. Are you on your way home? Nana started showing up everywhere I went. Have you been waiting for me to come all this time? There's no need for me to wait, because I know. Sometimes I just want to be alone, so can you please stop lurking and waiting for me? I told you, I'm not lurking and waiting for you. I just know. She takes detours to avoid being caught in the act. No matter how hard I try for her not to find me. Narita! Spispy! I know you were here, Narita! I understand everything. I know what's on your mind, Narita! Ah! Puni! It's a brand new Japanese horror! I'm already dreading those words. <laughs> That's a disaster. Nana has been skipping class lately because she's been going to Narita's. What a terrible obsession. But... That's strange. Narita's spirituality is supposed to be phony. I wonder how she knew where Narita was. Days like this go on and on, and I can't sleep at night. I can't get any food down my throat. You're getting affected pretty bad. I'm sorry to hear that. You're just sorry to hear that? Why are you acting like a stranger, Haru? Poor Narita. You'll never get away from Nana for the rest of your life. Huh? You've got to be kidding me. That's the kind of girl she is. Unfortunately, you will have to marry Nana. What? I don't want to do that. It kind of makes me sad too, but... Huh? Why? No, it's nothing. 
Anyway, Nana is tethering, you know? Oh no, I thought you would help me, Haru. Sorry, I don't know if there is anything I can do. Spicy, be gone! I knew you were here! Oh, ah! Narita! I knew that you were here, Narita! I know everything! I know everything about you, Narita! Ah! Boa, Nana! Huh? Haru? Hello? What? Why are you with the Narita, Haru? Um... Um... Well... Apparently... She doesn't like the fact that I am with Narita. I am destined to end up with Narita anyway. But you know... So don't get in my way. Only I am allowed to be with Narita. What? That's messed up. Whatever. Just stay back. Get out of here. But... Hey, Narita. You like me, don't you? Because we're destined. Of course you like me. We even promised to get married, right? We'll raise two kids in a two-story house. Um... Uh, no. You just said it by yourself. Huh? What? I said that by myself? What? What are you trying to say? Oh, I'm sorry. Nana, let's stop it now. I don't want to interfere with your love life. But you know, it's just not the right way to go about it. I consider you a friend, so I'll tell you. Shut up! What's the matter with you? Oh, I get it. Huh? Haru, you're saying that because you're jealous of me, right? What? You're jealous of me because I'm cute and I have so much power, right? I'm sorry I don't know what it's like to be an unattractive girl like you. Hey, Nana, that's too much. Ugh, I can't do this anymore. Who would envy you? You don't have any friends except me. If you can read people's feelings, you should consider how Narita really feels. What? I really have no idea what you're talking about. I know everything about Narita. Right, Narita? Um... See, Narita doesn't deny it. It seems my words don't reach Nana. I'm not sure I can remain friends with Nana anymore. In fact, she told me not to pretend to be her friend. That was when I thought that... Oh, the one over there. Is that you, Nana? Oh no, the Professor Teriyama? Professor Teriyama appeared. He is the professor whose class Nana has been skipping a lot lately. Professor Teriyama is famous for being very scary and angry. And now, in front of us, Professor Teriyama is clearly angry. Nana, you have the nerve to not attend my class. You don't attend class, you don't do assignments, you don't even turn in assignments. What in the world are you doing? <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Try skipping class even once in the next few weeks and I won't give you any credit. What? Please don't do that. <laughs> you feckless student. Um... You don't have to say that much! Oh, I'm hurt! I'm not a feckless student! Karina, comfort me! You really are! Hey, Nana, you said you're a charismatic spiritual college girl, right? So it means that you could have seen this coming, right? Um... You can read the future, but repeating school is lame, don't you think? All of a sudden, Narita! What? You weren't able to read what I was going to say? Did I hurt your feelings? I hate liars, you know. But that? Oh, this is the worst! Narita, you're so tough! 
When I did my best to locate Narita through social networking sites and personal information, you're an, an inquisitive spiritualist. But that's how you came into you and where Narita was. Uh, Nana, you little. Uh, you annoyed Narita so much, you know? I want you to leave me alone from now on. Yes, yes, I understand. I was tired of playing spiritual already, so bye! What? Since then, Nana has started taking classes seriously. It was somewhat awkward and I began to avoid Nana. Huh? That person over there. Huh? Ah, uh, it's Nana. Haru, you're actually worried about Nana, right? Why don't you call out to her? Yeah? I guess you're right. After all, Nana is my friend. Um, Nana, how are you? Uh, hello, and Narita. Hello. Hello. Um, what are you doing here? Ah, I tried to pretend to be a spiritual girl to somehow get attention. But it didn't work, right? Well, but I'm cute no matter how you look at me, right? I'm sure there are many other ways for me to be popular. That's why I'm researching. <laughs> I was a little taken back by Nana's toughness, but I was impressed. 